According to the Alzheimer's Association, one in three seniors dies with Alzheimer's or another type of dementia. The most common cause of death among Alzheimer's patients is aspiration pneumonia. This happens when, due to difficulty in swallowing caused by the disease, one inadvertently inhales food particles, liquid, or even gastric fluid. Alzheimer's can happen to anyone, and unfortunately, many famous people's lives have been cut short because of it, including actors, musicians, and athletes. Alzheimer's disease and dementia can affect anyone, even the rich and famous. Let's go and find out the celebrities who died from Alzheimer's. Charlton Heston, the Oscar-winning actor was a supporter of Ronald Reagan and a five-term president of the National Rifle Association of America, NRA, after announcing he had Alzheimer's disease in 2002. Heston retired from both acting and the NRA presidency. He died at the age of 84. Bob Barker, Barker hosted The Price is Right from 1972 to 2007, making it the longest-running game show in North American television history. He also hosted Truth or Consequences from 1956 to 1975. Barker died from Alzheimer's disease at age 99 in 2023. Geraldine Fitzgerald, the renowned Irish actress died at age 91, following a long battle with Alzheimer's disease. In 2020, she was listed at number 30 on the Irish Times list of Ireland's greatest film actors. Peter Falk, best known for his role as Lieutenant Columbo on the series, Columbo, Falk's death was caused by pneumonia, with complications of Alzheimer's. Rita Hayworth, shortly after she was diagnosed in the early 80s, the Hollywood bombshell became one of the first celebrities to publicly share she had Alzheimer's. Hayworth's decision to speak out helped increase public and private funding for research. She died at age 68 from complications associated with Alzheimer's disease on May 14, 1987. Burgess Meredith, with a career spanning over six decades, the iconic actor was famous for his distinctive raspy voice and his ability to portray a wide range of characters. Meredith died at age 89 from complications of Alzheimer's disease and melanoma. Leela Kedrova, the Russian-born actress won the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress for Zorba the Greek in 1964. She died of pneumonia, having suffered a long time with Alzheimer's disease. Etta James, the renowned blues singer suffered from chronic leukemia and Alzheimer's. She died on January 20, 2012, five days before her 74th birthday. Lily Dimita, the French-American actress and singer appeared in 33 films between 1922 and 1937. She died of Alzheimer's disease on March 21, 1994, in Palm Beach, Florida, aged 89. Gene Wilder, mainly known for his comedic roles, and also for his portrayal of Willy Wonka in Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, 1971. Wilder died from complications of Alzheimer's disease. He had been diagnosed three years prior but kept his condition private. Edmund O'Brien, one of the most respected character actors in American cinema, O'Brien's career spanned almost 40 years. He died of complications from Alzheimer's disease at age 69. Iris Murdoch, the Irish-British novelist and philosopher was diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease in 1997. She died two years later in Oxford, England. Eddie Albert, the American actor and activist was nominated for the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor for his performances in Roman Holiday, 1953, and The Heartbreak Kid, 1972. He died of Alzheimer's-related pneumonia at the age of 99. Arlene Goloka, often portraying bubbly, eccentric blondes, Goloka is remembered for playing Millie Hutchins on the television comedy The Andy Griffith Show and Millie Swanson on Mayberry RFD. At age 85, she died due to complications from Alzheimer's disease.